we see in the Western world nowadays uh, a kind of a mentality and narrative which is really harmful. A narrative of sanctions, a narrative of countermeasures, as if those uh, measures were a solution to anything. We know, I'm not theorizing, I'm, I'm saying that the world knows that sanctions never produce the results for which they were intended. They produced a variety of negative results, clearly. 近年来，国际格局复杂演变，在全球地缘政治竞争加剧的情况下，各方应如何应对全球性挑战？三月二十六日至二十九日，博鳌亚洲论坛二零二四年年会正在进行。在全球地缘政治展望分论坛上，与会专家学者共议解决出路。Regional conflicts have global implications, and not just political, but economic also. The conflict in Ukraine has driven a commodity cycle, which uh, has affected vast parts of the developing world. It has affected Africa, Asia, almost every country in the world. Even Europe has been affected very seriously. And then we see very unfortunate and condemnable incidents like. The terror attack in Moscow a few days back, which we all condemn, we condole with the people who were killed there. But these are the unfortunate facts of 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 these conflicts. We see the conflict in Gaza, and the theme of this conference is also common challenges, shared responsibility. So peace is a shared responsibility. 斯洛文尼亚前总统达尼洛·图尔克指出，当前西方国家大搞制裁、反制，这样做并不能解决分歧，反而会加剧冲突。在解决地区冲突的问题上，中国给出了一个很好的示范。I would say, well, things still can be done and should be done. And China is a good example of a constructive approach to most of these geopolitical problems. Uh, in the case of Ukraine war, China has produced a working paper last year in February, and that working paper uh, offered a kind of a conceptual framework for further work, for further action, for peace. Philippine 前总统格罗利亚马卡帕加尔阿罗约表示，在解决地区军事冲突时。人们有西方方式，也有东方方式。西方社会往往通过武力解决问题，而东方方式则以合作、对话为前提。Jimmy Carter took a call about China from a concerned Donald Trump, and、uh, his、uh, answer was, "China has not wasted a single penny on war. That is the Oriental way." And and Newsweek further quoted Carter as saying. Since 1979, that was when Carter opened relations with China. Since 1979, do you know how many times China has been at war with anybody? None. And they said, but we, the U.S., have stayed at war. So to resolve a conflict now in the world today, especially one that turns into a military conflict, you have the Western way. I I would call the Western way, and you have the Oriental way. And I think the Oriental way of ASEAN. Is the best way. 与会嘉宾指出，通过沟通解决国际纷争的东方方式，或为实现世界和平提供新智慧。I have worked in the United Nations for many years, and I have worked with ASEAN for many years in that context. And over the years, I became I became quite aware of importance and wisdom of what was called the ASEAN way. That you know, you have to respect and understand your partners. And you have to strive for common good. I think, in that sense, the ASEAN way is、uh, not only a big、uh, contribution to cooperation in Southeast Asia or in Asia more generally. It's a big contribution to human experience and to the future of the world.